I am Anil Kumar sharing a question from one of our subscribers. The question here is a rectangle has perimeter of 44 cm and area of 72 cm square. Determine length and width of the rectangle. So, so we have a rectangle here whose perimeter, perimeter is sum of length and width times 2, right? So let's say this is uh, side length and this is our width then the opposite sides are equal right so this will become length and this is width so in our case perimeter will be twice length plus width right and area will be length times width from these defined variables when we say perimeter is 44 we could write this as 44 equals to 2 times length plus width or 44 divided by 2 is length plus width which is 22. So 22 is length plus width. Now we can isolate and we could write, well, let's write width as length, right? So we can say 22 minus length is width. So that way is we get one equation. Now we know area, which is given to us as 72. And we are also given that length and width their sum is 22 right so now we can substitute here and solve so area is known to us so area is 72 for us we'll write 72 for area length and width we'll write this expression which is 22 minus double correct so we can call this as our equation 1 right so we'll sub and this as equation 2 so in this stage, we'll sub 1 into, perfect. So we get one equation. Uh, <coughs> sorry. So L, right? So, okay. So that's our equation. Now you can actually solve this equation and get the result, right? So we get 72 equals to 22L minus L square, right? This is length, length. Bring them together, length square minus 22L plus 72 equals to 0. Now factor. We are looking for product and sum. So let's two numbers whose product is 72 and their sum should be minus 22. So what are these two numbers? This is what you need to work out, right? So if it becomes difficult, what you could do is you could just factor 72, right? So if you factor 72, we could say, well, 72 is uh, what? If I divide by 4, I get 4 times 1 and 4 times 8. And you see, when you add these two, you do get 22. Correct? Now, since we need negative, so both should be negative. Does it make sense to you? Correct? So, that is how you could factor. So, we have two numbers here. So, we can now write this as L minus times L minus 18 it should be equal to 0. So that gives you two solutions L equals to 4 or L equals to 18. Right? So these are your two solutions. Well if I substitute 4 here then I get W as 18. right? So, so if I write let's say if I substitute 18 length we want bigger one right. So let us say we take this one right. So if I do 18, I get this as 4 equals to width, right? correct? So that could be one combination. It doesn't matter what you call one as. But anyway, we know one of the sides is 18 for us and the other side is 4 for us, correct? So that gives you the solution. And our answer is that the length, normally we put longer side for length is 18. Don't forget the units, right? And width is equal to 4 centimeters. You can always check your answer. So if you add them and then multiply by 2, you get 44, the perimeter. If you just multiply them, you get 72, the area. So I hope that makes sense. So feel free to write your comments and share your views. And if you have any problems, don't hesitate to share. Thanks for watching and all the best.